unfortunately for Binifre, he looks always like an accident ready to happen. And this might be it, and oh, great shame from Sunday Rotimi there. That was beautiful, beautiful pride from Bayelsa United. A lot more like it there. Ask him the questions they need to ask, and another one just going over the bar. But this is much better from the restoration boys, you must say. And the nearly restored parity there. And that followed good endeavor up front. Man was turned. They substituted to me, to me who was involved here. But uh, the final effort, very good indeed, and it needed uh, a top quality stop. And I said, the team manager of the side, recently made a team manager. And a chance! Goal number three! The defense of El Kanemi completely went to sleep. And Samad Kadiri has made it three for Bayelsa United. Saw what it meant to the coach. Coach Derekumo George kneeling down to salute that goal scored by Samad Kadiri. Unbelievable goal. There were so many, as many as six, seven defenders of Academy Warriors in that ball. So still had his foot to that ball. Let's take another look at that goal. Now, why Samad? Kadiri did not take to dancing perhaps beats me he showed more skills while dancing that he could have converted but then great agility and great follow-up on this occasion getting the better of three defenders including goalkeeper George Michael and chipping that ball second time out above goalkeeper George Michael showed this dexterity and some bravery on his part despite of three players of the opposing team and what about this for a dance oh, round? Mike look at G from Sunday right to me and that's when Bayelsa United seem to have got a new lease of life. Another chance there, and the chance well squared the ball, very unselfish, perhaps too Oh, an attempt at uh, getting something. The ball had already beaten the goalkeeper Sunday Rotimi. In fact, it was Fred Eagle and uh, good interception. And the very last uh, ditch interception from the substitute Ebuka Nebu. You have to look at the second half of the game and say that in terms of spread. Samad offended. Samad, one of the busier of the Bayelsa play strategies. Four pass that. And a good opportunity. seems to know exactly what he's doing here and it's worked for him thus far Hazan and Samad in to change in passes but in the end who have largely been under the coach great passes Hazan now for Bayesha United who have largely been under the coach great passes <laughs>
trying to up it for Sunshine. Samad. Samad crosses. Watch. I couldn't turn properly. This is Senu. Looking for Samad. He gets in. Samad. He was on target, but uh, not too strong. That was a good try from uh, Samad Fodri. My revelation of the day, Ilyasu Senu, the Burkina Bay, expertly chipping the ball across the defense. Samad chested that ball, turned around, and hit the ball, but there was no venom in that ball. As Kazim Yakini just plucked it effortlessly. Ojo, Sunshine take possession. Ayosaka sending it forward. And that's a shot from Samad. They took a deflection, and that's why it is a corner kick. The corner kick ended up being, but the short way it was headed down, Samad was well positioned. He went for the field, but then the ball was headed out by Isaac Mene. The corner kick away. And Sunshine, oh! Would have been something else. Let's take a look at if what really happened. A long kick that was from Abiodun Akande, flicked by Okiki. All Samad had to do, being in a vantage position, was just to carry on that ball. Some other authorities would say he was infringed upon and could have been a penalty. But then, referee Neji felt that he was in total command. Mike, that was a clear penalty. It's like it was a weakness in the Okanemi Central Defense, as we yet again see Samad being tripped on the foot by Alaji, Mohamed Alaji. For that, Alaji has earned a yellow card. The very first in this game, coming in the very first few minutes of this match. But then the central defensive peripheral can name it, that consists in ways the have been pretty weak. For me, they are the weak link in this team. They might prove to be the Achilles heel of El Kanemi. Not surprised they've considered so many goals this season. Let's see how that pans out. Freaky comes uh, for the side. And of course, it is. Uh, that's a very good free kick. And that is the first goal. The goal. Now, that is what I call inspired substitution. Originally, Ovoke Bernard shouldn't have played this match. Eric Frimpong was scheduled to play the match. But because of his tummy upset, we then have him come in. And he saw the follow-up then, and that was a superb pile driver by Samad. He did very well knowing that George Michael could not handle that ball first time. And superbly. Kadiri. Looking for his man. A chance coming. And this looks like the second goal. And it's two. Turn of the day, and what a goal! At this one, even better than the first one. It takes a brave player to do just what Evoke. They are using him stealing the ball, having stolen that ball from Opara Chukwebuka. He saw an advancing George Michael. He was brave enough to chip. He beat the ball from under. Try that, George Michael. Very, very instrumental uh, to the two goals. A chance coming, but it's a fourth goal. Evoke. Hat trick for the man. He was never to start this game, but it's on and getting a hat trick. I see it for his third. Well, Ralph, when I told you that um, El Kanemi are used to considering five goals and perhaps on their way to consider another. But today, I mean, he's a close follower of uh, his native Bielsa United. And I said, the team manager of the side, I recently made a team manager. And a chance! Defense of El Kanemi completely went to sleep. And Samad Kadiri has made it three for Bayelsa United. So what it meant to the coach, coach Derekumo George, kneeling down to salute that goal scored by Samad Kadiri. Unbelievable goal. There were so many, as many as six, seven defenders of El Kanemi Warriors in that ball. So still had his foot to that ball. Let's take another look at that goal. Now, why Samad Kadiri did not take to dancing, perhaps, beats me. He showed more skills while dancing that he could have converted. But then, great agility and great follow-up on this occasion, getting the better of three defenders, including goalkeeper George Michael, and chipping that ball second time out above goalkeeper George Michael. Showed des dexterity and some bravery on his part, despite the attention of three players of the opposing team. And what about this for a dance, Mike, look at Gia. Uh, look at uh, 